Welcome to the Engineerable channel. In this video, I'm going to show a better way to make the electrical connection to this 5 horsepower pool pump motor instead of using a push on connector. So even though they provide these terminals on here that allow you to put push connectors on this pool pump motor, I really don't think it's a good idea because the previous one, the wires burned up probably because of a poor connection there. And this one when it was redone, the terminals were really loose, so loose they were just barely holding on. Now I've tightened them up to do some testing and made it better. But when they were installed on there, they were very loose. But I don't think these provide a good connection over time, especially not in a pool pump room. And they're already pretty close to their current limit, which seems to be about 30 amps. So if this motor is around 20 plus amps, then it's reaching pretty close to that current limit. In fact, you can see that the insulation on this connector is already turning brown, meaning that it was overheating and discoloring the plastic and probably eventually going to fail. So what I'm going to do instead is crimp on some ring terminals on here, just like the ground is, and use these screws to attach the ring terminals, such that it creates a better electrical connection that we know is secure. So these screw terminals here they look like they're intended for spade terminals because they only come out right, right, yeah. about this far. Got it. So the position that they intend the spade terminals to be attached looks like they would cross over each other yeah. right here. So these screws are not really meant to be completely removed. Like I said, they're meant to be used as spade connectors. However, they do back out if you use enough force on a screwdriver and it doesn't seem to mess up the threads. So to make sure that there's no chance of the connectors coming off, I'm going to use these ring terminals and put the screws to the ring terminals. And should be able to bend this terminal up a little bit so that they clear each other because of the weird interference between the two. 